Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I'm going to explain and practically demonstrate how to take screenshots in Selenium using output type as bytes. So let's get started. So in the previous sessions in my Selenium training series, I already covered how to take screenshots in Selenium in the normal way where the output type was mentioned as file. Okay, but here output type is bytes. So how to take the screenshots when the output type is bytes is something I'm going to cover in this session. This is a sample code guys. Okay, which we'll be using while I'm demonstrating the, this session. So here guys, uh, we have this project created, Selenium demo project. It's a Maven project, which is already configured with the, uh, it comes by default anyhow with the Java library. And along with that, it, uh, it also has this web driver manager and Selenium libraries now. Okay, the latest Selenium libraries now as per the today's stage. Now I'm going to write the code guys. So that is a uh, Selenium code I'm going to write, web driver manager dot Chrome driver dot setup. Then here I'll say web driver, driver is equal to new Chrome driver. It's also done. Now import this web driver from Selenium library and also Chrome driver class also from Selenium library. Now driver dot maximize the browser window is manage dot window dot maximize. Then driver dot H. Here I'll provide the application URL that is uh, the sample application URL that is tutorialsinja.com slash demo. I'm going to provide here. After opening this application, I want to take the screenshot of this home page here. Okay, here itself, I want to take the screenshot. So what I have to do is I have to type catch this driver. Since I am declaring this driver with this web driver interface, it's required for us to type catch this driver. Okay, so driver and type catch this driver using take screenshot, takes screenshot okay it's an interface guys. Okay? again surround this with the circular brackets the statements around with circular brackets and then say dot get screenshot as this is the one of the method in selenium and here we have to say output type dot instead of giving here multiple options are there. instead of giving file that we have already done in the previous sessions i'm going to use bytes here it's going to return you the byte array output type is byte array okay and select byte. Sorry, I selected something else. So let me select bytes. Okay, I'm selecting bytes here. And now hover the mode on text screenshots and uh, import this text screenshot from Selenium library is also done. Now, as I already mentioned, it is returning you byte array. Byte array. So byte array is equal to something. Okay, I'm writing byte array. Okay, you are getting the screenshot in the screenshot is being taken here, guys. But uh, by array screenshot, you can see. Okay, by array screenshot. So let me minimize this. Okay, so that you can see the complete code here. Now, guys, thing is, now you got the byte array screenshot. So we need the destination location. Okay, in this project, uh, there is some screenshots folder, guys. I'll delete this. Okay, I'll freshly create the uh, screenshots folder here. Okay, so just uh, here we have taken the screenshot, but where the screenshot need to be copied in this project? It should be copied un under one folder. Okay. You can create a folder guys right click on the project and create a folder you can name that as anything just let's say screenshots is a folder name okay screenshots is the folder name so just now i created the screenshots folder name so i'll now say file file is equal to okay so i'll say destination file okay better it will be more okay the place where uh, de uh screenshot destination file it's more even better okay screenshot desti destination file okay file screenshot destination file is equal to new file okay the place where we want to the screenshot has been already captured in the byte format byte array format but this has to be copied okay or written into the screenshots folder under the screenshot folder the screenshot should be saved for that we have to first create this uh, file known as screenshot destination file you can give any name here i'm giving a proper name here and here i'll mention system dot get property get property i'll say user dot dir this will get the project path okay see till selenium demo project path it will get plus here i'll say double backward slash okay double backward slash under the screenshots folder i want the screenshot to be same so i'll give the name of the screenshot guys it can be anything so maybe it's a tutorials ninja home page right so i'll write something like tutorials ninja home home dot 
some PNG extension I'm giving here. Okay, some PNG extension I'm giving here. Done. Now import this file from Java, java.io package. Now here comes the thing. If you want to the screenshot, if the screenshot is already captured, it's stored in the form of byte array. And if you have to uh, move this uh, screenshot that has been captured in the form of byte array into this uh, destination file, then here we have to use something known as file output stream. Okay. In Java, we have something known as file output stream. Okay. FOS is equal to like, like this, we have to create an object called a file output stream. Output stream. And so where you want to output this particular screenshot, the destination location we want to output. So I'll import this file output stream. And here the constructor cannot be empty. I'll provide this screenshot destination file. After this, the error is gone. Okay. The file output stream will copy the screenshot which is taken or captured in the form of byte array format into this destination file location that we have mentioned here. That is under the screenshots. Here, spelling mistake is there, guys. We should be very careful. Screenshots folder under the tutorial in home.png with the name and extension it will be created. So now finally, in order for this particular screenshot to be uh, written in uh, written or copied into the screenshots folder, finally we have to say fos dot write, right? And here we have to give the byte array. What is a byte array? The captured screenshot is nothing but the, the captured screenshot which is in the form of byte array we have to provide here, okay? Byte array screenshot. That's it guys. This is uh, another way of capturing the screenshot in the form of byte, okay, byte array, and then mm, copying that using the file output stream onto the screenshots folder. Now, uh, if there is any problem in the code, an exception will come. If not, here we'll be printing out something uh, saying that uh, screenshot is taken successfully, okay. If we get this message means we, we are very sure that uh, under the screenshot folder, screenshot is captured and put, okay? And finally, I'll quit the browser, guys. I'll quit the browser, okay? I don't want to browser open after the script is done, after the screenshot has been taken. I want to quit the browser, okay? Now let's run this code. Right click run as the obligation. So let's see how it goes. It will open the Chrome browser, maximize the browser, open the application URL. Then it will take the screenshot and close the browser. You see screenshot is taken successfully. Then now reference the screenshots folder, guys. Let's see whether the screenshot has been taken or not. You see the screenshot has been taken with the given name. That is tutorials in the home.png. Let's right click on this. Uh, let's open this screenshot, guys. Okay, let's see the screenshot here itself. You see whatever the screenshot we thought of taking has been taken by this code. So, hope guys, you understood uh, how to take the screenshots in Selenium using output type as bytes. So that's all for this session. Thank you. Bye.